Good evening. I'm weather forecaster Rachel Scherfee. We saw a line of storms starting to move through our area and that's going to continue throughout the night. You can see a whole bulk of storms coming into southern Indiana, making its way northeastward to our viewing area. If we go ahead and take a look at our current temperatures right now, despite the rain, we're sitting at pretty mild temperatures, 56 in Muncie, 56 in Indianapolis, a little bit warmer, 58 degrees in Bloomington. But the real story right now is the wind that we're seeing. We're sitting at 30 miles per hour wind gusts in Muncie, 29 mile per hour wind gusts in Indianapolis. And that's prompted the National Weather Service to issue a wind advisory for our area. Now wind advisory shows that we can see gusts up to 50 miles per hour. So go ahead and tie up some loose objects outside so they don't get blown around in the wind. But our area is not the only area experiencing this threat. If we zoom out, we can see all the way up from Michigan down into western Texas is experiencing this wind advisory lasting until 10 a.m. tomorrow. Now those winds are going to continue throughout the night. We'll be seeing 25 mile per hour sustained winds gusting up to 45 miles per hour. So again, make sure that you tie down any loose objects outside in the overnight hours. Now those winds are going to be accompanied by rain overnight but we'll be sitting at an overnight low of 49 degrees, which really isn't that cold. You just have a lot of wind and rain tonight to make it a little bit unpleasant. We take a look at tomorrow though, we're gonna have a beautiful day. We're seeing 62 degrees as our high under partly sunny skies, but again, that wind advisory is still gonna be in effect, so we are gonna be seeing sustained winds of 25 miles per hour out of the southeast, bringing that warm air up into our area, gusting up to 40 miles per hour. Now we've been seeing some pretty warm temperatures, but unfortunately those aren't going to last too long. We've seen 62 degrees again on Wednesday, 60 Thursday. Take a look at Friday though, 30 degrees, a 30 degree temperature drop from 60 all the way down to 30 on Friday. We'll see it recover slightly Saturday and Sunday, but it'll be accompanied with some rain, but I'll get to that a little bit later in the forecast. Now we can see the blue in the jet stream start to dip down, bringing the colder polar air right over Muncie. And that's going to be right when the 30 degree temperatures are going to be affecting us. But we'll see the jet stream start to pull northward again, bring us some of the southern air again. That's the warm up that we'll be seeing the rest of the week. Now with the jet stream moving through our area, we do have a severe weather threat on Thursday. Now the SBC has issued a slight risk for our viewing area, for most of our viewing area. A slight risk is a level two out of five. So our main threats are going to be heavy downpours, localized flash flooding, and some gusty winds again. That was a lot of information, so let's go ahead and take a look at our seven-day forecast. We're seeing 62 degrees on Wednesday under partly cloudy skies. Thursday, we do have that 70% chance of rain under 60 degree weathers. Now that cold front moving through with that rain is going to drop the temperatures down to 30 degrees on Friday. The overnight lows dropping into below freezing ranges, but the temperatures will start to rebound over the weekend and into early next week. Thank you for tuning into Newslink Indiana. You can follow us at Twitter at NLI Weather for more updates.